body art. Tattoo and piercing is becoming increasingly popular in today's youth, with celebrities such as Angelina Jolie, Robbie Williams and David Beckham showing off some of the best. But I want to know what the London public think of this. Let's find out. Excuse me ladies, hi, how are you today? You all okay? Having fun? What are you doing around London? Right, okay, that sounds good, that sounds good. I'm just doing a little bit of a topic on tattoos in the media and, and, and piercings and things like that, body art. Are you guys a fan? Do you like that kind of thing or is it, is it not you? I'm indifferent, really. Oh, right, okay. But do you think, like, uh, like to David Beckham, who's got full sleeves, do you think that's a good thing or a bad thing? I'm really boring. I just think each is their own. So if oh, you like them, okay. then I Yeah, fine. that's fair so, enough. That's yeah. absolutely fine about yourself. David Beckham's tattoos. Yeah. Just a quick update on the Nelson PK Crashgate scandal. I can now confirm that Flavio Briatore and Pat Simmons have now left the Renault team. Just a quick question, we're on the topic of tattoos and piercings in the media today. Do right. you have any opinions on that? It's, I don't know, I don't know. No, not really. I think, is it a bit unhygienic or... I, I, is it or not? I don't know. I, that's, the, that's the vision I get. A bit, yeah. Dirty. So you don't like David Beckham sleeves or like Angela? No, I'm Michelle no, not really. I, I, piercings and all that sort of thing. I'm not really too fussed about. Right, okay. uh, I can understand why people do want it because it's art and it, it's quite creative yeah. with the skin and things. But um, but you sort of think art belongs on a wall, maybe? Yeah, I, you're right. Like actually, yeah, I think yeah. so. Yeah, <laughs> I, yeah I'm, I don't think I'm that comfortable with it on the skin. I don't. I, yeah. yeah. Zanzibar is just six degrees south of the equator. Not only should it be known for its white sandy beaches, but also it's one of the few places on earth where you can swim with bottlenose dolphins. Um, we're at the moment, uh, we're just doing a little bit of a, a study on um, tattoos in the media um, and body piercings and things like that. Are you guys a fan, David Beckham, that sort of thing? David Beckham? Well, I He's like got the, false leaves. Yeah, I like the David Beckham, but I don't like the tattoos. You don't like the tattoos, what makes it uh, yeah, I've got nothing against it, to be honest. But um, um, okay. yeah, not so, not a huge fan of David. Angelina Jolie, do you like hers or a bit too much? I don't know. I don't know what they are. Yeah, she's. I don't know if you've ever seen the film Wanted, but you get like a full body shot. And she's pretty much covered. Uh, so um, yeah, that's yeah. Nice. But you think they're a bit too much? Do you think they put pressure on the youth of today to sort of be like that, or do you think it, it doesn't affect anyone? You and a friend could get the chance to see Christina Aguilera perform. All you have to do is answer this question. What was the name of Christina's first single? Was it A, Genie in a Bottle, B, Dirty, or C, Candyman? Chatting about um, tattoos in the media at the moment. Tattoos in yeah, the media? Yeah, so David Beckham, who's, you know, he's got full sleeves and that sort of thing. I think David Beckham is going to come unstuck sooner or later, big time. Oh right, okay, what gives you that impression? The sort of fashion icon that he is... Yes, yeah. Um, ...is false. Right, okay. You look at him, he's supposed to be a footballer. Yeah. But this guy has got himself in so many pies now that his football tends to come second. Right. And he's building up himself up where he's um, putting his children's Perfect. photographs about. Mm. He's into this and he's into that. And most celebrities that have gone down that road have not lasted too long. As we can see from today, people aren't really affected by tattoos in the media, which I think is a good thing. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you next week.